Hello, welcome back to my channel. It's been such a long time since I've done a Disney video. Like, this feels so weird, but so familiar also because this is exactly how I started my channel. But I'm here today in a cute Mickey Walk Disney World, well, Florida um, jumper. It kind of reminds me of the purple one that they sold in Walt Disney World. Also, I feel like my camera is a really odd angle. Uh, I'm just gonna sort that. I have got my little cute Mickey a mini pillow in the background because it is literally like three, four days till Christmas. Four days. Four days till Christmas. So I've finished work, I am chill. So I thought, hey, I'm gonna film what's in my my Disney Parks bag slash lounge fly for Disney World. So I'm just gonna show you this lounge fly just because she is the star of the show at the moment. Um I'm scared to use it, but with Christmas coming up, I feel like I need to whip this out today. So yeah, I'm gonna use this as a reference of the size bag that I take to the Disney park. So I have a Walt Disney World trip coming up very soon. I'm not prepared. Yeah, this is what I'm planning to take in my, my bag, my parks bag. It's been a long time. I haven't been to a Disney park since 2019 and this is my first time to Walt Disney World. So this is pure, going off of what I've had to take to Paris but more well, uh, well this is like the kind of bag that I think I'm going to take but because it will be next year um, obviously it won't be Christmas so I'm probably not going to take this one but it is lovely nevertheless I do, I have become a sequins fan but yeah, look at this emerald, like how pretty is this? I can't even but yeah, so this would be the size bag that I would take. I will be taking a lounge fly. So um, yeah, that is around the size that I'm going to be taking with me. So this is what's in my Disney Parks bag. Obviously, I really want to pack light because if I buy anything or get anything whilst I'm out, I don't want to be like carrying a really heavy bag. So um I will be taking deodorant obviously because I'm going to be walking on my feet all day, it's going to be hot so I'm going to want to top up my deodorant, however I will buy a smaller tin than this, maybe like one of the mini ones to carry around because this, or like a roll on, because this is just going to be far too big and annoying in my backpack so deodorant 100% will be in my bag but just not this size so yeah, that will be in my Disney Parks bag. A scrunchie, I feel like I'm probably gonna have my hair down for like two minutes and then I'm gonna be so hot that I'm just gonna wanna chuck it up. So loads of scrunchies um, are gonna go with me. But yeah, just like I always have like a scrunchie on my wrist or in my bag, but probably better to have it in my bag just in case it accidentally gets fallen off or something. So a little scrunchie or a little hair bubble or something along the lines will be in my bag. Plasters, 100% plasters. I know for a fact, like already, I'm going to get blisters. So, plasters are going to be a must, and I'm gonna probably need a lot more than this, but I'm probably just gonna take like a couple in my bag and have loads in my suitcase, because I know for a fact, within two days, I'm going to have blisters, or like, my feet are gonna hurt, because I'm gonna be doing so much walking that I'm just not used to. Chewing gum or like mints or I don't know something to like freshen up with because I'm gonna be eating all the Mickey snacks like all the Mickey snacks so I'm gonna need chewing gum or something to like you know freshen up with so chewing gum it's just nice to have like after you've had lunch whatever well we're going to Florida so sunglasses obviously Probably not these ones. These ones aren't that great. They're just from Next, I believe. But they don't really do much in the way of keeping the sun out. So I think I might have to invest in a slightly better pair of sunglasses. Um, but yeah, sunglasses I think are going to be a necessity whilst being in Florida. So I will be taking some kind of sunglasses. And another thing that I haven't got right now is sun cream. Um, I'm going to have to get like a little bottle to go in my bag and like one to do in the morning. So yeah, sun cream probably loads of, but I haven't got one right now because currently I'm in the UK and it is grey and rainy every day at the minute. So yeah, sun cream right now isn't um, something 
I have accessible. Ah, oh, hey! My cat's just walked in. I will definitely be taking is a nail file. Um, as you can see, my nails right now are shocking, but I do snap them all the time. So like this one's really short, these ones are really long. Yeah, so it's good to have a nail file just to tidy up any like snags or like tears in my nails. So I will be getting them gelled before I go so that hopefully they shouldn't snap. Um, I'll probably take like a little compact like mirror slash like eyeshadow just to be able to sort out my makeup and things like that. I feel like it's handy to have a little mirror like to check your teeth like after eating but yeah so a little this is just um the Too Faced Kitty Likes to Scratch um palette and I really like this one it's got some nice colours. Look at me I'm like a beauty like <laughs> video person right now but yeah this is just some really nice basic colours so it's post 2020 hand sanitizer is a must so this will be coming in my parks bag it will probably slot in like the side or somewhere like really accessible so 100% hand sanitizer not be going without my purse so I have got a little lounge fly purse I use this like every day this is my everyday purse so it's so worn and dirty right now but I love it um so a little purse like this I think is perfect it just slots away it's not too big um but yeah I lounge fly purse is a must for Disney World especially a cute little one like this, this is my little Cinderella one so yeah a little a little purse to keep your coins in your money in and that explains itself you need a purse a little phone charger so I think you can actually get like chargers and then you swap them out in Disney World I could be wrong that could be something they've done a long time ago but I will be taking this little portable charger which is from Caf Kitson. Um, it is quite an old one so I probably need to get a new one as well just in case but you can't have too many portable chargers so this 100% will be in my park bag because I know for a fact my phone's going to die at like halfway through because I'm going to be taking so many pictures and videos so yes this will be 100% in my bag that's got loads of my hair in it, that's gross. It's just a wet brush. I got it from TK Maxx, I think. So just a small little hairbrush because like I say, your hair's gonna get frizzy, probably. Hairbrush, handy. Lipstick, my go-to lipstick. So that's my go-to lipstick. You can see like I've literally used it. So um, I have got another one somewhere, but for some reason I've lost it. And that is just the e.l.f. Um, Nectar lipstick. And it's my go-to everyday lipstick. I wear this literally every day. Going with the lip theme, um, just a Carmex lip balm. I feel like the like hot weather will like dry my lips out. So yeah, just a little lip balm and probably like a little hand cream as well. Always comes in handy, but definitely a little balm. So that will be in my bag. Oh, this is quite big, so I don't know if I'm actually gonna be able to fit this in my bag, but it will be handy and it's just a wireless this I say that it has a wire in it right now to charge it but it is a fan but how cool is this and you can turn it down I think that's really cool so it's just a little handheld fan and you can charge it so again if it runs out I can plug it into my little portable charger fabulous um, but that's all I really have to say about that. A fan is probably going to be quite handy to have. Um, I'm planning to vlog this trip, so hopefully I can get some content. And I will be taking the Canon G7X, which I feel like is the OG like vlogging camera that every YouTuber ever owns. It's just the old faithful, so it's quite compact, it just slots away. It will fit in my lounge fly quite nicely, so yeah, the, ca the Canon G7. X and I feel like that's going to be really handy for Disney World when I want to vlog, take pictures, things like that. So, this will be coming with me. Um, so, if you're looking for a vlogging camera and you're like wanting to start YouTube, I recommend the Canon G7X as your first vlogging camera because it's done me really well. I have got like a few cameras now, but I still do go back to this one. Um, and to go with that, 
the <laughs> gorilla pod or the joby it says it says mine is a little bit broken so i probably should think about getting a new one eventually but it still does the trick so yeah this is can just be like bent and you know like attached to things so this is really handy to have in my bag and it's quite small it just slots into one of the pockets or down the side so for the days that I'm vlogging these two together is very good um, spare batteries just spare batteries I'm gonna need them just a little perfume just to keep smelling sweet and I'm loving this one at the moment because it's so cheap um, it is called gardenia or gardenia I'm not sure how to pronounce that fully, but it is from Zara and it is just basically a black opium dupe and I've only had it for a few weeks and I've already used this amount because I just love it. So I will be buying more um, and having this as like my little backpack version. I just realised there's happy holidays on it. How cute. But yeah, so that is one of my favourite perfumes. I think it was like seven or eight pounds for this little bottle and it smells amazing and I get a lot of compliments. So get yourself some gardenia but yeah just a little small perfume I just remember one more thing this little bag clip I got this from Etsy last year um, and it just clips I can't clip so basically I fell over roller skating the other day and I've busted my wrist but this so cute um, so it just kind of like clips on to your bag and then you just slot your ears through the little loop and then clip it so you can put your ears on your bag so that you don't have to worry about your ears falling off on any rides or anything. So yeah, a little bag clip is a good little gadget and I got this from Etsy. So if you just type in like Disney ear bag clips, they're pretty cheap or you can make them yourself. It's just literally what it is. It just pops open and then you can put your, your ears inside of there. Um, it's brilliant and it's a great, it's come in handy for like some events that I've been to which have been like Disney themed and stuff I've been able to take my ears off when I'm getting a headache and um, you know the Disney headband headache is real um, oh and finally my last thing which mm, I'm umming and ahhing with this take or not but I think it's so cute when people do so I'm, I might try um, it's the little Numios um, or Nuimos I never know how to say it Numios? Nuimos? I don't know but people take these to Disney parks and get little outfits for them and take pictures of them at the Disney parks. And I think it's so cute, or they have them like in their bags. Um, so I'm tempted to take my little mini, but then I also might just see if I like one out there, like a little Donald or something. But I do really like when people take these to the parks. I think it's so cute. Um, and I love my little new emo. <laughs> but yeah, so I have no idea. Should I take her or not? What do you guys think? But yeah, that's all that I have in mind to take in my bag. And it's quite a lot of stuff and I'm hoping it will all fit. Um, but obviously you don't need to take all of it every single day. So, you know, you can swap and change what you think you're going to need for what park and things like that. But yeah, I think that is the essentials of what I, what I want to take in my parks bag. So let me know if there's anything you think I'm missing or that I should add, especially for Walt Disney World, because I am not completely sure. So yeah, if you think I'm missing something and you're like, you need to have this in your bag, let me know. But at the minute, I think I've got what I need. I could be wrong. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I shall see you in my next video. Bye.